Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I just got a radio in the mail from Ham Radio Mall. Link in the description in here. Full disclosure, they contacted me and asked me if I wanted something to review from their website. And of course I said yes. So I already have analog radios. So many, many moons ago, my first radio, my handheld, was the VX7R, which is discontinued by the way. Yezu VX7R, it's an analog two meter repeater radio. It's been very good and very stable. Not too long ago I bought a Baofeng and it's it's not as good a quality. You know, this is like underwater. This can take some water and stuff. Not as good a quality, but way cheaper, right? So I got it just for fun and played with it. Okay, so Ham Radio Mall contacted me and said, would you like a radio? And I said, of course, give me a radio. <laughs> I'll put it on my channel. Full disclosure, they gave this to me for free um, if I did a video. So I said, they said, which radio do you want? And I said digital because I had heard about digital um, about 10 or 11 years ago. I moved to St. Louis. I went to a ham radio club meeting and they were talking about digital radio then. And I was like, yeah, hey, I'm a CW guy. I'm an HF guy. I don't really care about digital radio. You know, it's like, I'll, if it's, I, w I never went out and got one. I'm like, so what? So when the opportunity came, I said, digital radio. Give me one, send me one. I'm very excited about it. So this is the TD, TID, digital portable, portable radio, which is DMR, digital mobile radio. All right, we've got the digital portable radio, TID. Some software. What is that? That's not software. What a trick. Card instructions. So what's kind of cool and surprised me was it came with a whip antenna. Very excited about that. I could use this on my other radios. I like that a lot. This is better. Better than, I wonder if it's male to female. So here we have the different type than my Yezu is the exact opposite type, just so you know. It's a very Japanese thing to do, I suppose. Japanese, I mean Chinese, sorry. All right, so we have our programming cable. I know this one very well. I need to label that right away. Programming cable to USB. Charging station. I know this very well as, as well. Tiny whip. Tiny whip. And the radio itself. Oh, I love doing that. Pristine. I'm going to go ahead and put this on here. Knowing full well. That is the best option. 100% do not know how this works. I'm going to charge it and figure out how it works in subsequent videos. Oh my god. Look at that. It comes with a microphone which looks a lot like USB. Oh god, there we go. That would obviously hook in here. And you could use a microphone with this. It comes with this, which I'm surprised. I had no idea. And this is a, it looks like a pocket clip or something. This is a nerd clip. We're going to put this, yeah, I'll put that in. Why not? And then you have a nerd clip on. Then you can look so cool with it right here. All right, guys, this was just an unboxing. I did not promise anything more, but I do promise more videos where I use this and I set it up and figure out when and why you would want to use digital portable radio, DMR, digital mobile radio.